price that was to pay for our sins was fully paid. Amen. We don't need to to be victim of uh, sin anymore. Amen. Amen. Because Elohim cleared the debt. Amen. That's why we repent. Amen. Amen. And then we are forgiven. Amen. Because the price was paid for. Amen. 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 If you see a believer today still living in sin, is despising the price, the redemption price that has already been paid. You are saying that what Yeshua did does not matter for you. Brother, do you know when your debt has been cleared? You can even look at the man you owed money. Put your hand in the pocket and tell him what are you going to say now? Because he has no effect on you anymore. And the one we owed was Satan. Elohim cleared the So Satan and his sins have no effect on us. Amen. 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 That is the reason why Yeshua, knowing the price was paid, he said, Go, Nenda. preach repentance to all the creation. And then after they believe and repent, teach them the forgiveness of their sins. Amen. Amen. If Yeshua did not die, if Yeshua did not resurrect, our presence here is null and void. Because he resurrected, we are happily standing in his presence. And he tell Satan, you have no power over us anymore. Whatever the plans he can have, in Yeshua's name, the promise says, the promise says, no weapon from the case of you shall prosper. The price was paid. Amen. That's what Paul says, it's madness for the people in the world. Amen. But full of wisdom for us who are Amen. 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 Let's work on our salvation. Amen. Amen. As we are standing, we are going to start to start something new. It's going to be all about the prophetic world. In Daniel chapter 9. We are going to start reading from uh, verse 29. Yes, Daniel chapter 9 from verse 20, 29 or 20? Yes, 20, sorry. Now, while I was speaking, praying, confessing my sin, and the sin of my people, Israel, presenting my supplication before the Lord my God for the holy mountains of my God, yes. while I was speaking in prayer, the man Gabriel 
to you, Le Gabriel, whom I had seen in the vision at the beginning, being caused to fly swiftly, reached me about the time of the evening offering. And he informed me. A man of God before preaching, you must be informed. Amen. Without information, you have no ministry. Amen. The scripture says, Isaiah said, What should I shout if you have not spoken? Amen. He informed me and talked with me and said, Oh, Daniel, I have now come forth to give you skill to understand. After you receive the information, you must also be able to receive skills to understand. Amen. This is how a true man of God who must teach others should go through. Even if you are to wish you are sour, Mungo Bana Paso Funza and Guinea Paso, that's why we are gathering here. Most of us are Kusanika. Because Elohim in our time he has spoken. Elohim is able to through Malachi 4 5 6. The powerful and prophetic ministry of William Marion Branham. The food was stored. And then after that one, the Marion Branham food was stored. After that one, Elohim raises a man. In charge of that food, in charge of that food, give to his companions. In two seasons, he says, At the beginning of your supplications, the command went out. And I have come to tell you, for you are greatly beloved, Daniel. Therefore, consider the matter and understand the vision. Seventy weeks are determined for your people and for the Holy City. Someone who, someone who knows how to write properly can write just there the 70 weeks of Daniel for Israel, no, for Jerusalem and for the people. As we are reading. 70 weeks are determined, fixed. Set <coughs> for your people and your holy city. You can see they are calling Jerusalem the holy city of Daniel. Yes. So it's not the holy city of the Muslims. Amen. Amen. Say amen. amen. He says, Why? To finish the transgression, to make an end of sin, to make reconciliation for iniquity, to bring the everlasting righteousness, and to seal up the vision and prophecy, and to anoint the most high. Everybody say amen. 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 Now, Daniel, Daniel, know therefore and understand from the going forth of the command to restore and build Jerusalem until the Messiah, the Prince, there shall be seven weeks and sixty-two weeks. The street shall be built again, and the wall, even in troublesome times. Everyone say amen. amen. Today I pray Elohim to help me go slowly so that even the little ones are here, they understand. Amen. 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 
Now. Now. And after the 62 weeks, the Messiah shall be cut off, but not for himself. And the people of the prince who is to come shall destroy the city and the sanctuary. The end of it all shall be with a flood. And till the end of the war, desolations are determined. Amen. 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 May Yahweh El Shaddai help us to go slowly and deeply for you to understand this prophetic language. Was it written what I asked? Yes. You are surprising. Even until continue, I continue reading and I finish, no one came to write. Oh, you are afraid. No, leave it. Leave it now. It's not the time I had asked it before. Now, according to the scriptures as we are reading, it's all about the people of Israel. Remember, we have already covered a very huge part where we talked about Israel. Two major signs of countries we were given by the Lord in the Laodicean Church Age. The first country that Elohim wanted us to observe in Laodicean time is Israel. Why Israel? If you want to know the time we are even now, you look at your watch. If you want to know the, the day we are in today, you look at the calendar. Wrong or right? right? If you want to know if it's going to rain, you look at the weather. Also, if you want to know prophetically where we are now, you must look at Israel. Israel and the happening in Israel tells us the time we are living in prophetically. Uh, in Matthew 24, Yeshua said, learn, learn, learn from the fig tree. The moment you will see the fig tree, who's putting back putting forth the leaves, he says, you know that summer is near. And Yeshua said, the generation that will see this Israel becoming a nation and all the happenings, it will not pass until it comes just like the summer Amen. Amen. Because summertime is the coming back of the sun. And because Yeshua is also the son of righteousness, natural things type spiritual. Ah. The people in the world have got the son called Jua in Swahili. Soleil in French. But we in the spiritual, we have got the same son, but the son of righteousness. Amen. We 
which comes after the very bad times. What is the time that comes before summer? Winter. What happened in winter? Life is paralyzed. Look at Yeshua. Before he comes back, what will be before he comes? Life is paralyzed. What is it? You will hear wars and rumors of war. You will hear destruction here, destruction there. You will see persecution here, persecution there. Yeshua said they will put you in prison. Have we been put in prison? Yes. Yes. So this is winter time for the church. Yes. Yes. When it's winter time, when it's trial time, the scriptures say, look at Israel. Learn from Israel. That's the first sign. The second sign, Elohim spoke to us. Through the ministry of Elijah the prophet, saying, We are going to have in the world politics treason. The fascism, which I've already explained to you here. The Nazism, which I've already explained to you here. And Communism. And in the Bible we have communism. If you want to find the communism in the Bible, communism means what? Having things in common. Correct? Is that correct? Look in the Bible. When the Holy Spirit fell in 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 the upper room. In the Acts of Apostles, the scripture says, All the brothers were together with one accord, and they were having everything in common. Because they were having everything in common, there was no one in the church who lacked. If you know the God alone, you bring it. Everyone has got his bring in. We look at the poor in the church. Uh, you, you need 10,000. Well, you, who brought it, you don't really need it. We give the brothers in In this way, in the church there, the spirit was moving softly. Smoothly. Ah. This morning I was listening to a publication my wife did where Brother Bram says, the problem today is because we don't pray sincerely. You need to pray until you get, you feel into the presence of God. Amen. But the problem, we don't pray sincerely. Amen. Most of us in the early church, we don't have time to pray. We take things lightly. We are there into phones, into TVs, into our business. We hardly have time to pray. Bible says we need to pray without ceasing. Amen. 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 What time do we pray? Some of us in the morning, some of us in the evening, and the rest of the day we are busy into things. No. I am disciplining myself. It happens even during the day. I stop what I'm doing. I just want to see God's presence. Just that. Then I continue. And Brother Brown says, if you pray that way, Christians, it's on a richer time when you want to do something wrong. The Holy Spirit warns you before you do the You will be in His presence. The presence of the Lord does not influence us anymore. What happens with the early church? We know too much. 
Yes. This one I know already. You know, this scripture I know. I'll just put in the picture. Napanga tu ifele is the thing that. So I know my text. And that, that knowledge is good. But it is also good to seek always to be in the presence of the Lord. One day we'll just come here. We pray. Amen. Yeshua said, Yeshua said My house shall am. be called the house of prayer. It means those who come in the house of prayer Amen. should be the people who know how to pray. Amen. 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 Very important. If you look at the life of Yeshua, he could just leave his disciples during the day. Eh? He disappeared. When he disappeared, the scripture says he went to pray. If Yeshua is Elohim, if Elohim is, there's nothing that can, you know, can be difficult for him. He speaks, it happens. If him, God made flesh, could be praying this way, what about you? What about you? And me? Brothers, let's get the habit of praying. You go to visit a sister before you start ma mazumuzo, sister, pray. You go to visit a brother, even if he's your neighbor, the moment he comes in your house, pray. Amen. He wants to live, pray. Amen. That's the life of the people in the scriptures. So Elohim spoke in our generation to brother brother. Saying, the three ism, the other two, first, will be swallowed in the third one. What is happening now? Why do you think we have got war uh, in Russia? It's because the last Nazist. Those last ones are in Ukraine. Ukraine. Yeah. Mm. Amen. They are still in Ukraine. And Ukraine. some of them are what we call today Hamas. But the prophecy says Nazism must be swallowed not by democracy but by communists and the communist by excellence today is Russia. That's why Russia is attacking Ukraine. Why? To finish Nazism. Amen. 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 We must only have communists. Amen. 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 That's the spiritual meaning of the current war in uh, Ukraine. Then the scripture, no, the, the, the voice says, Watch Russia. Next time we need to have a small button stick. Eh? We have a nice so, like so I show you here. Israel is here. Israel is here. Russia is there. Russia and Ukraine they are attacking. Now, as we speak, this part of Ukraine is already taken. Taken. Already. Now, what is this doing here? They are actually eliminating the last. People who are still in Nazi. <laughs> the moment they are doing this, the prophecy says, People, watch Russia. Keep your eyes on the king of the North. Russia is all the way here. 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 Russia is all the 
Kuna baraf. What town? Yani ni maji tu. There is no country above Russia. Hakuna taifa lililo juu The Bible Urusi. says Russia is the farthest north. Yani maandiko yanasema Urusi iko kaskazini ya mwisho. What will, what will be his work? They will gather there with all these other Arabs who surround the Israel. Look here. All the green part here. All the green are Arabs. They will be come up here from Russia. And the Bible says they will come from the north to attack Israel. Do you see what I'm talking about? Yes. So now check. What was the first warning? Watch Israel. What is the second warning? Watch Russia. But they are all coming in connection with in connection to Israel. At the same time, who are these people here? The brothers of Israel. Are you saying that? Now, because Israel will be fought against for the salvation, do you see that Israel also needs salvation? How many enemies? Count all the green countries here. Enemies. On top of that, Russia. Israel needs salvation. Otherwise, they will just finish them in the Mediterranean Sea. And this red part disappears. Now, here is the program of redemption. So, you cannot redeem Israel without redeeming the people connected to Israel. You, you cannot redeem Naomi without redeeming Ruth. Oh, you don't understand. Naomi represents Israel. She was a Jew. But Ruth was not a Jew. A Jewish lady. She was not. She was a Moabite. But because Ruth said, Naomi, Naomi, I'm not going back to my people. Then. They are witchcraft. They are into magic things. In my people, we don't know Elohim. I have decided. My husband is dead. It's him who could take me there. But now, check. Because he's dead. Your God will be my God. Your word will be my God. Wherever you go, you go. where you will be. This lady, a gentle woman, was attached to Ruth. It's because of Naomi that uh, what is the name? Ruth got married. Wrong or right? Wrong or right? So if it's true, and now they say to Oprah, or Oprah, I say, what is your sin? I'm going back to my village. Me, me, I'm going to the Catholic Church. And we believe in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. She went. The Bible says, she had nothing to do with Naomi. Say amen. amen. This represents the Catholic Methodist Baptist Presbyterian. They are all gone. But there was a young woman who was also a Moabite. She said, Where you go, I God will be my God. She took the stand of Naomi. Everybody say amen. Church today, when the whole world is against him, we are the only church. And we are praying for the peace of Jerusalem. So Naomi says, Please, go. I don't have a child anymore. Even if I was to conceive today, and have a child, I am going to wait until he grows up so that he marries you. He said, Ruth, please go to your God. Naomi says, Do not push me away from you. Until 
Naomi could not speak anymore. Then as she was going back to Israel, Ruth was also there. Because she has already linked herself to her. You cannot save Naomi without getting in return also Ruth. So the plan was this. The one who's going to get Naomi must also get Ruth. So if God must save Israel, there must be a church that must also be saved. That's why Naomi knew Boaz. Israel knows the God of Israel. We Naomi. Oh, sorry, we we Ruth. We, we only know the people of Israel. Amen. We went to Israel through Ruth. When we reached there, oh, Boaz came. Boaz was not a young man. Boaz was an old man. And still is very strong. Ah. Yeshua is the old of He said, the rock of ages does not get influenced with the time. Uh, he's always the same. Yesterday, today, and forever. So now check. When Naomi came, the only see Naomi coming back in Israel with the roof, the Moabite. The people were like, what's happening here? Naomi also took her into the field. He said to her, now start teaching her. My daughter, you see, we are in Israel. These are the servants of God. These are the uh, Jeremiah. They are also working for the, the Boaz. Boaz is the boss. You see that, Muse? Yeah, he's got the power of redemption. He said, I will not lead you to all this later. I only want you to look at that man. He's old. He's got the power to redeem us. We have come back. We have lost everything. We have lost everything. We have become poor. We want to be redeemed. Women need redemption.
kumngojea kila mtu akishakwenda kulala. So wait when Boaz will go to sleep. Mpya subiri wakati Boaz ataenda kujilala. So what I will tell you what to do. Okay. Mm. Now they see her only working. Wanaona ana shughulika tu. Brother, no. She was working there in the field of Boaz. Wanafanya kazi katika For Boaz to notice her. Ili Boaz aone. Comment, comment a lot of them, but is, they can be doing things to be noticed. But, uh, Alex, you are smiling. Is that true? <laughs> then Boaz came and said, He asked now the other workers, Who is that young woman? She is very different from this other woman. Brother, already the early church is different. Yeah. <laughs> 
Church, which is 
not in Israel now. Church, Kanisa. whatever you allow on earth, Amen. Amen. So please, brothers and sisters, do not have problem with the true church. Do people like If we curse you, trust you me, you can be for some month or some years. But, lazima neno it. The word must be fulfilled. Amen. 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 Even if it takes time, the scripture says, wait. Amen. You say, oh no, since you cursed me, everything is okay. No. So beard. Just wait. Just wait. My son, your nan is willing to have beard. <laughs> yeah, every time, daddy. Because something here, daddy. Like so beard. So
70 weeks are determined, verse 24, determined for your people and for your holy city. Say amen. amen. So it's not for us. I don't know if you understand. The 70 weeks are for whom? Abraham and his people and the city in the land God gave him. We are not in the process. Amen. But Elohim will introduce us, will insert us in the Israeli program. Amen. Wow. Because what he said to Abraham must become a reality. Amen. That we are blessed in Abraham. And Abraham was, was given two things. Abraham was given two things. One physical and the other one spiritual. What was physical? The land. Israel is fighting to protect the land. Israel for them, the land is everything. It was a gift given to Abraham. But these people of Israel rejected the other thing God gave to Abraham. What? Faith. The faith of Abraham, they rejected. That's when now we, the spiritual seed of Abraham, and what do we do with faith? We fight for this faith Just be way and help us is touching the word of truth which you know. You become Benjamin Netanyahu. You find someone speaking bad against the word. The same way Israel is fighting physically to maintain and protect the land. Yeshua said, He who loves me will keep my command. Amen. And we will persevere fighting for this faith. It was given once for all. It was given to whom? To you? To me? But to Abraham. That's why today I want to show you the full cycle of the forgiveness of Israel. Now, check. I don't know if you can be able to see. We have 70 weeks. Basi, tuko na majumu wa sabi. There are also, in some places, 70 sabbats. Basi, sayamu nyingine zinaitwa sabbat wa sabi. So now, a week has got how many days? Basi, juma moja likona siku ngapi? Juma moja likona siku saba. Equals to? Seven days. Am I correct? A sabbatic or a prophetic week has got prophetic week has got seven years. This is a prophetic week. Seven years. So if we have got 70 weeks, we are going to do 70 times seven, which gives you exactly on the dot 490 years. Someone can read there. Matthew chapter 
chapter 18, verse 21 and 22. Somebody, quickly. Mtuko upesi, asome Matayo 18. It says what? Verse 21, 22. It says. Yes. Then Peter, then Peter came to Jesus and asked. Listen, 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 listen. listen. Look at me, look at me all of you. After showing the people how to deal with the, the problems in the church, you having a problem with me, I having a problem with you, how do we solve this one? He said he talked about the confrontation in the church, which we call Matthew. Eight. So in any church, when you tell someone Matthew 18, they don't understand only the scripture. They understand what? Brother Awa, good to see you. When I say we have to do Matthew 18, it means what? It means we have to solve that problem. Ah. Brother Duncan, Duncan. you know what is that? Stand up. You are lost. Move in. <laughs> Brother Alex next to him. Alex. To do Matthew 18 means what? A confrontation. It was the man. He talked to me things. About the brother. And he's nothing. Huh? Hey. You think I will believe you? No, I will believe you in front of that person <laughs> you are talking to about me. Okay. You are talking about to me, sorry. Yes, hey, brother, how are you? Hey, brother, you have to come also. Will you repeat to me what you were telling me about him? If you are telling the truth, you will be okay. But if you are lying, you will start sweating. Why? Because lies in the presence of God cannot stand. Uh, you will become or you will be identified as the serpent. Now, read. Then uh, Peter came to Jesus and said, Brother, did you get the calculation? Yes. Do you understand how we got this? Yes. The 70 weeks of Daniel is 7 times 7 years. 70 times 7 years. <laughs> Which gives you 490 years. Why this? What's the mystery, Brother Peter, about the 490? Let's see what Yeshua said about this one. Yeah, he said, Lord, what? when someone won't stop doing wrong to me, <laughs> just like Israel has not stopped doing wrong to God. Is that true? Yes. Yes. Is that true? Yes. Is that true? Yes. How many times Israel has been Offending God. Many times. Here Peter is asking a no more question. When Brother Ivans has done something wrong to me. And he keeps on doing the same thing to me. How do I forgive someone I can forgive once or twice. But if you come the third or the fourth time, I will give it to you. So Peter knew it. He did not know from the time of his fathers, the people of Israel have been wronging God many times. Then you ask him, God, how many times if I wrong you, you can forgive me? Amen. Amen. Oh, talk to me, man. Amen. How many times are you expecting God to forgive us? Brother Reed, and check. Here, Peter in Israel is talking to Elohim made flesh. So he's talking to the same. Israel has been wronged. 
Sikia. How many times? How many times must I forgive them? Then Seven times? Seven times? Seven. In the week time? How many times? Read. Yeshua answered. I tell you, you must forgive them more than seven times. Say amen. Amen. Continue. You must continue to forgive them seven, even if they do wrong to you, seventy-seven times. Amen. Amen. Seventy times seven. Wait a minute. If we need to follow Yeshua, then Yeshua was saying that the number of forgiveness. The number of redemption must be check. It's him speaking to a Jew. Say it. I'm not telling you seven times. It's himself. But I'm telling you, even if he continue doing the wrong to you, to you, to you, to you, to you, seventy times seven. Amen. If, if you look at Yeshua, the number or the times of forgiveness of Israel or of a brother or your family member it's 70 times 7 which marks the number of grace the number of forgiveness wait a minute the 70 weeks are given for what? Now check a minute. It's what? It's for? I said what? The number of forgiveness. Go with me quickly. Daniel chapter 9. Verse 24. Someone, can, someone else can read. Yes. Daniel chapter 9 verse 7, 24. 70 weeks are determined. Yes, Brother Moshe. You're not there. I'm here. God, yes. God has allowed 70 weeks eh, for your people and your holy city. Yes. Amen. Say amen. amen. <laughs> for what? You are not translating. You are not translating. I understand he's also learning. Amen. For what? For Read. So. The 70 weeks are ordered for these reasons. Listen to Babi. To stop doing bad things. Ah. Amen. 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 Continue. Uh, to stop. Uh, to stop sinning. Amen. When you've been forgiven, Yeshua said, Go your way. Sin no more. Amen. Amen. The 70 weeks were given for Israel so that Israel can be forgiven. Amen. We will reach it. So now here, because we are talking about Abraham, let me give you something. Up to now, everyone is with me. Yes. Everyone is understanding. Now, eat a question as this. Okay, this one you have understood. Where is the rubber? Kifutio kikoapi. The thanks to wife. Kifutio. We are going to see. Tunaenda kuona. This one I will have to put it here so that I can be writing for you to understand. Okay, let me just put it here. I've put four. Uh, marks here. The first one 
This story we started it with Elohim started it with who? Aditi Elohim alianza na nani? Abraham. So Abraham is our reference. Kwa hivyo mtu ambaye tunazingatia ni Abraham. From the birth of no from Abraham sorry. Kutokea kwa Abraham all the way. Njia yote hiyo when israel became a nation and israel was to exit Egypt. we have what 490 years then when we got here exodus remember elohim said to abraham Your people will be slaves for long. Hey, so it was only left the 90. I thought you could clap. They will be slaves for 400. Wait a minute. When the time came for Israel to receive Yeshua, who was the redemption Moshe in time wakati wakati ulikuja wakaomba Israeli walipaswa kumpokea Yesu ambaye alikuwa ni mfano wa Musa listen carefully the people of Israel said to Moshe who established you here to be our child you want to kill me the way you killed the Egyptian The 400 years were already there but because they did not know, acknowledge the day of their visitation <laughs> Moshe ran away from Egypt for another 40 years <laughs> we are now reaching 440 years Amen. Amen until the time now came Plus the days of um, what is them again? Uh, the family of Jacob increasing in uh, Egypt. It got them exactly to the dot. When Elohim remembered them, 490 years they came out. Now, from Exodus, they started walking until they reached the promised land. They were now looking for Elohim to come among them. And then they started staying in the land. They were having tabernacle with the skins, skin of animals and the leaves and all those things. They said, no, this is not good. Elohim, through David, arranged everything to build them a temple. Is God wanted now to dwell among them with a house called a temple? A major event was Abraham to be called. A major event. Israel going out of the, 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 the slavery land. Another major event. God leaving his kingdom to come on earth to dwell in a house built with bricks. David, after he, he arranged everything, Elohim he said, no, first of all, a prophet of God called Nathan went to David. He said, David, you are very powerful. Oh, with everything you have done, you have expanded the kingdom of Israel. Mm, you are the one who built the temple of the God, of the Lord God. David said, mm. David said, yes, yes, I will build that. The same night, God went to, not to David, to David said, you have preached a first doctrine. You must go back to David. Tell him, I preach lies. That's the time we have the test. You must come here and correct here your preaching. But you're not just correcting here and you go. Must 
maswali lazima yaandamane na wewe. Amen. Yes. Ndio. Maandamano ya malipo maswali. You must ask questions. Yes, no, maandamano. Yes, maandamano. Demonstration of questions. Yes. Yes. Amen. Utalapa. Ndio. Utakoma. You will be the first of you. Yes. Stop. Preaching for the church, we are not just uh, uh, meeting. Uh, we have something we protect here. Do not touch our faith, which was given once for all. We will not have another faith. If you destroy this, you lose it once for all. Amen. 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 Oh, I'm feeling very good. In the morning, Nathan stood up. David, uh, Elohim told me, this time around, what I said there, it was my old notes. My old notes. My, my, my thinking, forgive me. Elohim said, you have killed too many times. Your hands are full of blood. Therefore, you will not be David did not get upset. Oh, now you have changed your doctrine. Now you are blessing me. Now you want to make me go. David said, because the lawyer said so, that's what it is. What happened? He said, I'm not jealous of the one who can be. Because it will still be me. But through my son. But for my son, you will be king. Because Elohim wants you to be king. What I was to do, I'm going to prepare ways for you to take over. Parent, that's why we, parents, we should prepare the children. And the responsibility of the children, when they come, they walk in their freedom. Brothers were very happy to tell me last time. Brother, if you have not been serious with us, if you have not been severe with us, we could not be doing the right thing. Look, man, we have gone to the east. We have gotten our wives under the supervision of you. And everything we did was according to the Bible. The women we married. We are happy because we are in God's will. That's the responsibility of parents. You, you want to do your things. You don't consult your pastor. You don't consult your pastor. For you, the pastor. Hey, you will reach a place where you don't So now you must also be humble like Nathan. To come back, the scripture says, for where you started from, go back there. Then start from there. Amen. Let me tell you, you cannot go wrong if you consult your pastor. Most of the problem you have, when you were you were started having the problem, you ignore your pastor. When something is in the beginning, it has not cost you anything. Just text. Call. I'm doing this one here. What, is it right? I will tell you. No, 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 stop it. Then. You save a lot of time. Ah. Oh, this one. It's okay. Go ahead. You will be blessed. So when they say, for instance, that for us, for Israel, Tanzania was chosen. Tanzanians have gone. Malawi was chosen. They are gone. The third country is Kenya. Let me tell you, when they talk Kenya, I don't see, I don't think there is another group. It's your group. I'm telling you the truth. We are a product of what God did to Israel. Of Israel is our God. Amen. The faith of Israel.
Israel is our faith. Amen. 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 Now check. They do who part, we do who part. We are the only ones. We are the only ones in Kenya okay. who do who part. Why? What is? We are spiritual Israel. Amen. Amen. They wear rings here. Not here. Not here. No, 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 not here. Not here. Why? We are Jew. So you will compare us with you. Catholic? No, I only watch a Bazia. Memories? They are lost. Just the way we say God, He has no one like Him, we also can say there is no church like us. We are special in a special way. In a special God. In a special way. Amen. 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 Speak to us. You will hear our wisdom. Amen. Our approach is not Catholic. Our approach is not Methodist. We are not Branhamites. We are the sons of Abraham. Amen. Amen. So from here, Abraham, Abraham to Exodus. Check what happened. Deliverance, forgiveness. From Exodus. All the way to the temple. The building of the temple. The dedication of the temple. We have another 490 years. One, two. There's another three here. Israel. Israel had no temple. Had a temple. Oh, you want a hekar? Yes. Dio. Once in a year, the the people can go to the holy, the most holy place to offer the sacrifices, and Elohim could forgive the whole congregation. Wrong or right? What a deliverance! Look at the hand you have both. Say amen. Four hundred and ninety. Wait a minute. Seven, seven times seven equals to what? Yes, you are right. Stand up. Seven times seven means equals to what? Forty-nine. Thank you. Check it. After the cycle of seven times seven is filled, the next year, which is fifty. Brother, look at me. Fifty. I'm seeing. In the Bible, fifty is what? I'm seeing it. Leviticus chapter twenty-five. Are you with me? Sava. Good. Sava. Oh, you just came late. My, my, my French guys there, they came late. Nous parlons sur les soixante-dix minutes. <laughs> Leviticus chapter 25. All of us, let's go there. You will be very happy discovering this mathematic set of Elohim. Amen. Now I'm going to read verse 8. Wait a minute. So be required. Check here, check here, check here, check here, whoa, 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 all of you. The people of Israel are leaving Egypt, going to the promised land. Do you agree with me? Yes. So as they are leaving here, coming to the promised land, they reach. What was the first thing they were to do when they reach, you reach a land? Look for a place to stay. Wrong or right? A place you to, to, to take care of the, the livestock. 
a place where you can have water. Obviously, am I right? Yes. So, Elohim will give them a time to build. That will take 49, as uh, your name said, 49 years. Building things and put things in place. In a country where everyone will be. The next year that follows uh, 7 times 7 is which year? 50. No, let's read what the Bible says about it. Well, because how? Because how? Yes, my brother. Watch your name again. The brother next to the museum here. Yes. Yes, you, brother. Yes, you. What's your name? Gina Gan. Sorry? Paul. Brother Paul. 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 Everything is okay. You like it to sell? Dawood. Brother David. He goes out. Go south. We are flying, huh? It's Naburuka, eh? <laughs> now check. Angalia. And you shall count seven Sabbath of years. Now you can hear some years about Sabbath of years. Seven. Amen. How many? Sabato Saba. Sabato Saba. So if we have seven years, how many Sabbaths do you have in seven years? How many Sabbaths do you get in seven years? Sorry? One! In seven years. How many Sabbath? One. Be simple. <laughs> In seven years, you've got one year of Sabbath. In seven days, how many Sabbath do you have? One. So in seven years, how many Sabbath do you have? One. <laughs> Now the scripture says, You shall count how many Sabbath? Seven Sabbath. So if we have seven Sabbath, how many years we have? Exactly. Many of you I want everyone to understand. Ah, thank you, Brother Peter. Asante sana ndugu Petro. One week. Sasa juma moja. Equal to how many days? Nisikunga. Seven days. Sasa juma moja. How many Sabbath? Sabbath onga. One Sabbath. Sabbath onga. Do you all agree? Yes. Is that okay? Yes. Okay. Now, one prophetic week. How many years? Seven years. Seven years. How many Sabbath? One. one year. One day. Okay. But the scripture talks about. Look here. Not one year of Sabbath. But the Bible says seven Sabbath. So for you to get seven Sabbath, you need how many weeks? Seven? Yes. Are you sure? Are you sure? No. Because out of seven years, you have one Sabbath. So for you to get seven Sabbath, now we go backward. Now we have seven Sabbath. How many years? 49. Because you must do seven times seven, which gives you 49. Yes. Did everyone understand? Yes. Second. 
I'm still feeling Chinese here. <laughs> Chinese are not getting me properly. <laughs> okay, let me start the first. What are you doing? 70 weeks of the year. Now, let me stand this. <laughs> I want to the sister to understand. Okay, who has understood the of Christ? Those who have understood. Okay, those who have not yet understood the of Christ. Raise up. Yeah, brother Petro also. Brother, yes, brother Paul. Okay, sisters. Now, check. How many days? Do we have in a week? Combien de jours nous avons dans une semaine? Set, seven. So, one week. Une semaine a sept jours, seven days. Wrong right? Is that clear? So, in the, in the seven days, how many Saturdays we have in a week? Wow. One Saturday. You have understood? So it means one Sabbath. Right? Monday, Tuesday, Sunday. No, you start with the Sunday. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Please also don't say Wednesday. Please. Wednesday. Not Wednesday. Wednesday is English of Mamamboga. <laughs> Wednesday. You say Wednesday. What is that? Wednesday. It's Wednesday. Do you also say Wednesday? No, I <laughs> only, they, only, only them they know if you say. <laughs> I don't say Wednesday. You have heard him saying Wednesday. Just be true. Don't yes. fear. <laughs> <laughs> Now, let's go back to the <laughs> So, in a week, <laughs> we have seven days. <laughs> Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. The last one is Saturday. <laughs> so, in seven days, how many, how many Sabbath do we have? One, one. <laughs> now, in a year, a prophetic year, a prophetic week, one prophetic week, I write PW, not power but PW, not power because PW it means also power, yeah, so now I'm talking about prophetic week. As got how many years? Seven years. It should be how many Sabbath? One. One. one prophetic Sabbath. Which means one prophetic Sabbath. Is that clear? So in seven years, you take one full year of Sabbath. Brother Martin. You, you have understood. Okay, good. Now, Yahweh says in Leviticus 25. Don't take one prophetic Sabbath. Oh, prophetic. No. Take seven Sabbaths. For you to get seven Sabbaths. For you to get seven Saturdays. So, first Saturday, second Saturday, third Saturday, third Saturday, one, two, three, up to seven. How many years are here, or weeks are here, for me to get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven Saturdays? You will need seven, seven what? <laughs> you see, you said I've understood, I've understood. 49. Is that clear? Yes. One month has got how many weeks? Four weeks, huh? So in a month, how many Saturdays you have? Four. Second month. 
four. So when you put two months together, how many Sabbaths do you have? Eight. Now, two months equals to how many days? 60 days. Am I right? So out of 60 days, I get eight Saturdays. So eight Saturdays equals to two months. Yes. Is that clear? Yes. And two months has got how many weeks? Yes. Four, four. Eight weeks. Is that clear now? Yes. Is that clear? Yes. Okay. When we we reach next Sunday, I will ask the same questions. <laughs> yes. Okay. Anyone who fails, I write your name on the board. <laughs> 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 I will start with yours. <laughs> now, if you have got this one in you, we are looking for seven Sabbaths. How many years do we need for seven Sabbaths? Forty-nine. Say amen. amen. Because to get it will be seven times seven. Amen. Because one Sabbath is already seven days. Is that clear? Yes. Okay. So, now check. The scripture we are reading here says this. Brother Derek. Who goes out? Okay, good. Leviticus 24, verse 8. You shall count seven Sabbaths. Say amen. amen. First, second, third, fifth. Seven years, pull one. Seven years, pull another one. Seven years, pull another one. Pull seven Sabbaths. So by the time you are reaching the seventh Sabbath, you are already 50 years, no, 49 years. Yes. Is that clear? Yes. yes. These are the people who left Egypt. The son killed it in Egypt. And they are now in the promised land. Yahweh tells them, count in that land. Seven Sabbaths. It means first year, second year, 10 years, 20 years, 49 years. In 49 years, we have got seven Sabbaths. Is that clear? Yes. Okay. Then he says, <laughs> seven times seven years. I was even thinking that someone could be very smart here to be because the answer the angel has written. Yes. Vous avez vu la réponse? Vous avez vu la réponse? Lisons encore. Levitic 24 verset. Wait. You shall count seven Sabbath of years for yourself. Yes. For yourself. He says seven times seven years. What's the answer? 49. Say amen. Amen. I wish you asked the Catholic this question. <laughs> we continue. Seven times seven years. In the time of the seven Sabbath of years shall be 49 years. Amen. There's a guy on who we always do. Then he goes. 
I have suffered explaining something which is already here. <laughs> but it was necessary for you to understand. <laughs> so here, those who get the revelation must write next to it 49 words. Now he says, then you shall cause the trumpet of the Jubilee. Amen. Amen. I'm not talking about any other Jubilee. Because in the kingdom we also have a Jubilee. Brother Manuel, is that true? I'm talking about the Bible Jubilee. You shall cause the trumpet of the Jubilee to sound Listen here. on the tenth day of the seventh month. Which month? Which month? The seventh month. It's not July. See you July. July of Kenya. July, it's not July. I was born in July. It's not this July we are talking about here. No. Seventh month of our calendar. No, we are talking about the Bible calendar. The Jewish calendar. Say amen. amen. It's happening on which month? The seventh one. And seven is the number of perfection. We have in the big God created the world in seven days. We have the seven files. We have seven church ages. We have seven days of creation. We have seven weeks of Daniel. Seventy weeks of Daniel. We have got seven angels. We have got seven seals. Seven tunnels. All right. Seven spirits. Everything about Elohim is seven perfection. Now here, here, he says, check again, it's seven times seven, it's only seven, seven, seven. And this is beautiful. But I don't want to talk about the seven. Now, check, he says, on the day of atonement, sorry, did you hear him say what? Upatanisho. Explain. Upatanisho. Upatanisho is a. In Swahili. Mistiku ya kurejeana. Watu ambao walikuwa na utofauti. Wanapatana. Wanakubaliana. Atonement. Upatanisho. Who can explain in his own word atonement? Nani anaweza elezea kwa maneno yake mwenyewe? Yes, brother Thomas, stand up. Reconciling. Reconciliation. Yani hali ya kufanya maelewa. Yes. Atonement. Siku ya upatanisho. It's the day of the forgiveness. Yes. I forgive you, you forgive me. We sacrifice to God, we become brothers. That day of atonement, you give the sacrifice for you to be reconciled. I want to lead you somewhere and we stop here. The 70 weeks are the town, town, very sweet, sweet, yes. But come out, Joe, man, my name, no, you are lost. Ah, <laughs> you don't know. You get to Napoleon, you let that. Now he says, he shall not say, on the day of atonement, you shall make the trumpet to sound throughout all your land. I feel like a baraboo, but I can't see it. And you shall consecrate. The fifteenth year. Say amen. Amen. You have done forty-nine years. The year that comes, the fifteenth year, you have to consecrate it to the Lord. Celebrate. Amen. You can hear French now. Wait a minute. Yeshua died. Yeshua died. 
resurrect. He said to the disciples, not many days from now, wait in Jerusalem. For what? There was a feast coming, which is the feast of Pentecost. Pentecost, which is which is 50. Amen. And on the 50th day of the resurrection, it was the feast of the firstborn. Where a priest must come in front, take the harvest, the harvest, the harvest. Yes, Mazao. Yes, the, the product of harvest. You shake it in front of everyone. And who was the priest? Yeshua. What was the firstborn? The church in the afternoon. He came. He took the church. And the priest He The real miracles, the real miracles were happening there. Why? Because the priest Yeshua took the firstborn, the church in Abraham. He shook it. The Bible says there was a big noise, and people came to see what was happening. Elohim, the priest, shaking the firstborn. Amen. Are you feeling uh, yes. the feast in the Bible? A prophetic feast. Amen. It's not just a feast. In the feast in the Bible, there's no Christmas. Amen. No. There's no Easter. I don't know Easter. If you, you know, you tell me. But I tell you, it's Ishtar. Ishtar is a pagan goddess. In the Bible, she was called uh, Ashtarte. Baal, the husband, his Baal, wife, your Ashtarte. She's also called Semiramis. Yes. Or Artemis. Or Diana. Diana. So if your name is Diana, shame on you. I've spoken many times about Diana in the past. Who, who remember how we taught about Diana? If you listen to the teaching, you will see also the Diana of UK. It happened the same thing. Same thing because of Diana. Okay, I don't have time now. Next time we, we, we have to put our clock. Eh? Oh, yes, it's uh, five uh, past twelve. Are you okay? Yes. Is everything okay? Yes. Brother, this we think is real for William Marion. I could not be able to teach you all these things if we did not open our eyes. Behold, I will send you Elijah. He will bring back. We have been brought. Oh, shout at everyone. If I was in the Congo, you could hear your cabilog. <laughs> Very good. Amen. Amen. Brother, when you hear things like this, you, when you go out here, you feel like demonstrating to people there. Don't talk. This game of Gamma, you talk about what you pass. Yes, be that way. Because I remember the Kinshasa. When Brother Pierre Cass was teaching this thing, the moment we finish, I had the brothers. We just go outside. Let's go and look for Philistines. <laughs> Between good and evil. Amen. 
between Israel and Palestine. Between, Palestine. between the early church and the denomination. This war will not end until Yeshua comes to be They will attack us, we also will attack them. As a result, they will put us in jail. Yeshua said, do not worry. Some of you they will put in jail. Some of you they will be persecuted. But let me tell you, he who shall persevere, Churches, we are not fearing God. Elohim, Elohim, who was fighting for the church in Jerusalem, will fight for this church. We don't fear. We don't fear. Don't wake up there. Oh, no. The scripture says. Take your case. Amen. Give it to Elohim. Amen. Keep quiet. Amen. That's all. See what he does. When the people were panicking, were panicking. Moshe, look at these people. They will kill us. Yahweh said to Moshe, don't fear the persecution is coming. Just tell the people, go ahead. They were going ahead. They were going ahead. And they reached there. Red Sea. Bahari Asham. Pharaoh behind. Mountains. Milima. Mountains. Milima. How to cross? Moshe started panicking. Now the people came to Moshe. Moshe, what are we going to do now? Moshe was overwhelmed. The church can overwhelm the pastor. <laughs> So when you have Shida, you come to me. So when I go to Shida, I say, that's why I have to be very well with Elohim. Where will I run? Remember the beer gas is also not here. What will I do? That's why Lazima ni tegeneze hii bridge. Moshe overwhelmed. Elohim said, the people panic, eat your game. But you, the pastor, do not panic. He said, eh? By the way, I must not panic. And he said, Moshe, what do you have in your hand? That's the time he's waking up. I've got the road. So he said, yes, just walk there to that water. Moshe got strengthened up. The battery was recharged. Problems can attack your faith. The same thing you know to do. Because of problems, you forget to do. But you see it? What are you doing? Yeah. <laughs> You're not translating. <laughs> <laughs> you go, hey! Is that translation again? He's eating. <laughs> then Moshe, Moshe. strengthened. <laughs> he said to the people, Hey, Israel, Israel, come down, come down. Come down! Too late. It's not too late. 
What people call too late is their will. But when Elohim's time comes, look, look at the married. Yeshua. Yeshua. They don't have one. Hey, hey. Miriam, what's wrong? You and me, what's wrong? You people, your time is always there. You want to travel, you travel. You want this one, you want to get money for this one. You want, you want to, to go to, 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 to Europe. You, your time. It's a Miriam. It's not my time. Miriam understood the same. Yes, Lord. She went and told the people, can't be a what? He said it's not the time. <laughs> I'm telling you, everything he tells you, do. And that's what the early church is doing. We are telling the world whatever Yeshua says. We are the real Miriam. The real Miriam in the Bible. Amen. We said to the people, no one is baptized with the Holy Spirit. Amen. It's for now, everyone must wait. Amen. It was not time yet. What happened? When the time came, Yeshua started moving himself from his seat. From his seat is what? It was time now. And people were like, there was no wine. What are we going to do? How much you have saved? There's no money. You see the feast in seven days. In the Bible, when you get married, the feast is seven days. It's on the seventh day you will see the woman. Yes. We don't need to see the sister before the seventh day. God bless you, sir. Amen. It's not so, sister. Sir. <laughs> Bible time. Yeah. Amen. My father and brother Pierre Cass left us there. On the church day. After the blessing. Because we were blessed on Friday. On Sunday he came alone in the church. The brothers were asking me. Where's the sister? Seven days. <laughs> <laughs> I will teach that one later. <laughs> it's beautiful to be married. Uh, according to the Bible. Yes! Even. Okay, never mind. So, what happened? Mary. After speaking this way, she left. Yeshua acted. Why he came? People took wine. Instead of thinking God, they start attacking. <laughs> That's what we also do. We have been drinking the Catholic wine. The Methodist wine. The all this wine. The day you tasted this wine. Don't you attack the Catholic now? I'll say it. You did not know that the priest must be married. <laughs> the bishops. But when you were there, you were drinking it. <laughs> ah, the Bible is sweet. Ah, very sweet. Then Moshe. Musa. Said the people, come down. Come down to Tunia. Let me tell you. Have peace. Amen. Let's nothing troubles you. Amen. Even if it's sickness, I can tell you the sickness you have is not what will kill you. Amen. It's not there for you to be made. It's not there you. It is there for you to experience the glory of God. Amen. 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 Then he said, People who are panicking. What to about from America? You see these Egyptians. Well harmed. Not coming to kill you. It is the last time. You will not see the last time. Did they say? How Moshe? Moshe turned. 
is back to the people. At the same time, the light that was in front of him went back to behind the people. Elohim stood between Israel and the enemies. No, mm. he will come here and 
message book. But you don't buy nothing. Don't throw him inside. 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 Say it, man. Yeah. They took yourself <laughs> in prison. <laughs> they removed him. <laughs> Send him to <laughs> Egypt. <laughs> in the nations. <laughs> he reached the nation <laughs> in the house of Potiphar. <laughs> there there was a woman <laughs> who saw that and this son is prospering. <laughs> like he is doing his prospering. <laughs> Everything he does is still. Now he starts looking at her. He says, ah, mm. if my husband goes to you, I will talk to you. Why? Talk to me when your husband goes. Mm. No, 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 no. Uh -uh. At night you receive a text. I can't you, you can't what? I can't sleep. I can't sleep. I want you want to say something so that I sleep. Say what? <laughs> <laughs> Yourself say. I have got the responsibility <laughs> from Potiphar. <laughs> Except you. <laughs> because you are his wife. <laughs> she <laughs> she <laughs> don't listen. Ask him. Until she became physical. <laughs> they took yourself. <laughs> after they lied. <laughs> Who is the preacher they lied against him in the time? He did not do anything wrong. He was right. But for doing the right thing, he was jailed. No, it's not finished. Now they took him, put him in jail. It was who? Because of whom? Wait a minute. If what this has been, who is this other man of God? Who has been put in jail because of him? Exactly the same salary. 
Amen. They spoke in tongues, we will speak in tongues. They perform miracles, we will perform miracles. By the way, by the way, by the way, we will have more than them. In the Bible, you saw Yeshua walking on the water, right? Peter also walked on the water. It's nothing. That's nothing. In our time, what you wait? We will call the cloud. Come, come. The cloud comes on the water. We will climb on the cloud. Amen. You will do that. You will do that. In the Bible, we have not seen a tree being removed from the root. Yeshua spoke about it. We have not seen a mountain be moved. Elohim, keep me alive. Mount Kenya. <laughs> <laughs> you shall do greater! Why? Because I'm going to the Father. Brothers and sisters, let's persevere. Uh, very soon, it's 11, and the Master is coming. Do not get a title. Let nothing uh, disturb you. He who shall persevere and do shall be saved. Amen. Amen. It's happening very soon. May Yahweh, Yahweh, El Shaddai, El Shaddai, the God of the Bible, the, the, God, the God of Boaz, the God of Abraham, bless all of you. If there is anyone who is sick here, receive the healing of the name. All the divine doors of Elohim, 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 Elohim be given unto you. Yeah. Go and prosper in everything. Yeah. Did you not finish? We will continue next time. Boaz, Boaz is Yeshua. Yeshua. The promise to Abraham. It should be fitting the 70 weeks of Next Sunday, I will tell you from Abraham to Exodus 490. From Exodus to the temple 490. Now, from that, the temple. To that Daniel. No, 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 no. To the time of, uh, we will see. Uh, you are there, you look at the brother who wants to know. <laughs> Which? <laughs> Next Sunday. Uh, it's not so, brother. I was the teaching. Teaching, uh, you are smiling. <laughs> Let's pray. Let's thank Elohim for his grace. Elohim. <laughs> Thank you.